Hey guys, it's a beautiful day out and I am sitting in front of the Dollar Tree. I've really missed making videos over the last, I don't know, six months or however long it's been. So this is going to be a lot of fun for me and I hope you enjoy it too. Let's go shopping. So this is one of the first things that I see when I come in the door, and this is so cool. Um, not only have they changed the texture of the plastic, but the texture of the other part of the plastic looks like stone. That's really cool. And it says, brighter light, the old one was pretty dang bright. So I think I'm going to get a few of these. Look how cute these are. Little bunny head. Oh, that's cool. Sidewalk stencils. Oh, these are pretty. There's four to a pack or six to a pack. They're like beaded eggs. Those are beautiful. Look at all these different baskets they have. Oh, a little chick. And a bunny, and a pink chick, and a green bunny. And more stuffed animals than you can chick a stick at. I got one of these to give to my dogs. It'll probably last like five minutes. Little glittery feet. These are some of the cutest stuffed animals I think I've ever seen at Dollar Tree. Mm -hmm. This one reminds me like of a washcloth and it's really soft. Here's some more um, Easter baskets over here too. We have some that are like, you know, like cardstock. Different designs. And then they have their sports buckets. Basketball. Baseball. And soccer. And then just their plain traditional basket buckets. I love that color. They have those in all different colors and then ones with little designs. Cute. And they have tons of eggs. Um, Walmart also has tons of great eggs. I like these colors. Those are pretty. And also, iridescent Easter grass. And they have more natural looking Easter grass too. Look, little hopping toys. They have little bunnies and chicks. That's pretty dang funny. Oh, and these baskets. Look at how cute that is. Oh my gosh, that's very cute. 
That is dang cute. The spring section, they've got hummingbird nectar mix and hummingbird feeders. All kinds of garden gloves. These are actually really cool because they're waterproof right there. I need to get some of those. I've never tried their bulbs. If any of you have tried their bulbs or their seeds, let me know. We bought some zinnia seeds before because we're crazy about zinnias, but we didn't actually plant them. Oh, look at how pretty these are. Oh my gosh. Oh. These are beautiful. Sometimes I put things in my basket that need to later be mm, pruned. You never know what you'll find. Gosh, that's so pretty. Peace, hope, and love. And look at all the little fairy houses. Wow. These are great. broke. And that one's broken. Is that broken? Yeah, that one's broken too. A little bridge. Gazebo. And the welcome sign. That's very cute. And little fairies. Bye, Stephanie. Bye. Bye. Don't have too much fun. Gnomes. Whatever. Thank you very much, ma'am. Come back to see us. There's another kind of pale, different designs. It's more of a, a tall pail. And they all have different designs. And then there's non shiny Easter grass. And there's some natural looking baskets. Oh, and look, they even have styrofoam coolers. Look, even more baskets or buckets. These look like produce baskets. How cute is that? More foam egg ornaments. Beautiful ribbon. It's a gorgeous color. Seeds and bulbs, seed starters, these pots here are good because you don't have to take the seedling out of the pot, it just biodegrades. I just noticed like some of these eggs are plain and some of them have stripes. I guess that's supposed to be a stripe. And this package is iridescent and this package is glittery. I think I'm just going to get the glittery ones. My 
handmade cards. I didn't see any that I couldn't live without this year. Oh look, here's yet another kind of basket. It's like the bottom half of an egg. That's dang cute. Blue, purple, yellow. Different designs. Oh, that's cute. Felt Walter. Oh, look at the bunny! Kind of a sucker for those little jointed figures. A chick and a bunny. That's neat. Somebody's going to get an Easter basket. Oh, yeah. Oh, how cute is this? I have this sign I got last year. That's neat. It's very vintage looking. Oh, 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 oh. Yes. Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh my gosh, everybody welcome. Okay. Kind of need this one. Oh, and look at this one. It's metal. And they have a steak. Too. No, they don't. It's just in front of that steak. And this is kind of like the Merry Christmas sign they had last year. That's pretty. That's cool. Very vintage looking. Oh, that butterfly is beautiful. Happy Easter. Oh, cute little signs. Egg hunt this way. Glittery door hangers. Window cleans. And then these things. I'm thinking there's a DIY in this thing somewhere, but I haven't thought of it yet. <laughs> First thing I thought of was covering him with moss. That would be cute. <laughs> this is a cottontail. Jump rope. I'm thinking this would be good for a DIY too, to make like a bunch of carrots, to buy like two or three of the jump ropes and cut the rope part off. And I don't know what you'd do for the carrot topper though. Look how big these are. Lots of um, stuff to put in your kids' Easter baskets. I don't understand this product. Oh, I think it's a rolling stamp. It's cool. Oh my gosh, these little, these erasers must come home with me. Whack-a-pack. I got one of these for my brother-in-law for Christmas or something and I forgot to give it to him. of cute little games. Here's another kind of a basket. It's shaped like a bunch of carrots. It's made out of felt. It's quite small, but it's very cute. And here's another large egg. Here's a, another sports bucket. 
see through and it has all different sports. This is the only one I've seen with a football on it. And then there's more girly ones back there. If you can't find an Easter basket here, you're not gonna find one. There's some small cardboard pails. There's some metal pails, small. Here's some more of those things that look like produce baskets. There's some natural looking, well, you know, more craft paper looking grass. This is, I guess, if you need to bring goodies to an Easter party, maybe to church. I see this maybe being spray painted white and filled with, I don't know, moss and a pretty white bunny. We got cookie cutters, goodie bags, glasses that look like a bunny. I didn't know what those were the first time I saw them. Gosh, this is cute. Microfiber. What is this? <laughs> That's funny. I used to do stuff like this when I was a kid. Put together a little creature out of pom poms. I don't really understand this. Circle tracing shapes? Are we supposed to trace the circle or the shape? I'm guessing the shape. There's another, oh, this is a much cuter pom-pom kit. In my opinion. <laughs> I might have to get that and do that one with my mom. Okay, that's pretty dang funny. Bunny shoots balls. Easter egg scavenger hunt. Well, that's cute. Wonder. Ah, there's the bunnies. I think I'm gonna get one of these too. Look, they've got candles shaped like eggs. Look guys, it's a six foot egg garland. It's like, it's, it's foam eggs with a ribbon threaded through and beads. Two, four, six eggs. All kinds of toys to go in the Easter baskets. Look at these bath toys. Little rubber duckies. Fish? No. Yeah, fish and a turtle, a shark. And then I think these are super cute. Eggs shaped like bunnies, eggs and carrots. Wait. Not eggs, bunnies, chicks, and carrots. These are tablecloths. All kinds of candy. Malted milk eggs. Peeps. Chocolate bunnies. Peanut butter bunny. <laughs> Candy eggs. Ooh, jelly bean eggs.
<laughs> Those fluffies seem kind of like, I don't know, a Halloween candy I've seen before. Oh, these are funny. It's a lollipop that makes it look like you've got a bunny nose when you're sucking on it, I guess. Hey, look, honey bears. No, they're two. Only. Hmm. Now later, marshmallow eggs. Candy bracelets, I guess. Oh, a tin pack. It's pretty good. No, not for this. Put it in there. Money, money. Gummy carrots. Got some very creative stuff here. Oh my gosh. It's a dinosaur egg. Oh man. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. More bunny money. That's cute. I'm gonna take the bunny. A bunny? Yeah. I got those chocolate ones and the white chocolate ones. I'm gonna give. We're gonna eat these. We're gonna eat. Carrot patch me, Pete. For okay. He's cute. What is this? Here's a picture of someone with another kind of lip pop. <laughs> Jelly beans. Look how cute that is. This is like kind of squishy. It's like a whole tower. That's really cute. Patty patties. <laughs> Actually, I had some Krabby Patties candy one time. It was pretty good. Little sweet tart eggs. All kind of things. Yummy bunnies. These are individually wrapped. Starburst. Oh, Tiger Pops. I think we had some Tiger Pops at Halloween. <laughs> Bunny with gumballs. <laughs> That's funny. These are pretty. Oh, look, some candy crosses. More little trucks. <laughs> Concrete. Shaped like a carrot. Also shaped like a carrot. Mmm. I need to get some of these. Marshmallow well, that eggs. was a lot, a crazy lot of stuff. Um, the uh, summertime candle holders are back. This time they've got a jellyfish. I never saw that one before. I got this one, I think, last year in teal. Look, a turtle. A fish. This is the color I got last year. Lots of stuff for St. Patty's Day. I made a wreath last year shaped like a shamrock out of foam core board. Be a lot easier to buy something like this and cover it in moss, although it wouldn't be nearly as big as the one I made. More of those cute useless rocks. 
And then look at this stuff. How cute is this stuff? It's getting picked over too. Oh, they're cute. Look, wooden stamps. How about that? So these look new to me. And look at these little page flags in the shape of hearts and gems. And little erasers. A little pack of three notebooks. Look at these cute erasers. They're like little citrus fruits. And look how small they are. Here's some more. I had heard people say there were Heidi, Heidi Swap stickers here, but I didn't really expect to see them. Isn't that interesting? Look at these really fanciful birds. They have them in all colors. They have beads growing at their butt. <laughs> They're very pretty though. More baskets. Lots of floral foam too. And craft foam. So they've got these completely adorable barrettes. And look, they also have little teeny tiny versions. I've never seen such a small barrette in my life. Cute. 